This project has been the most important of all the projects that I have done throughout the two-year course. For the final major project, we were asked to submit a series of images and developmental workbooks that would eventually be displayed in the end-of-year exhibition. I found this project the most difficult out of all the projects that I have done on this course. At one point, I wasn't even sure if I could finish because of all the stress and pressure that I was feeling. I had a lot of problems like loss of images, a broken camera and finding models. I had managed to overcome all of these problems and complete the project right on time and I did it despite my terrible time management. My name is Megan Curry and I called my project Life with a Time Traveller. These are my final images that I have produced. My original influence was the BBC television show Doctor Who. It's where I got the idea of time travel because I think time travel is fascinating. The idea of steampunk came from a book that I bought on the works of Edgar Allan Poe that was illustrated by Denko Basic and Manuel Sumbrak. I think the idea of time travel was brought across well, but not so much the steampunk. The images that are supposed to be set in the Victorian times have the most steampunk qualities. The reason they have the most steampunk qualities is because it is the only section with the most steampunk props, like the gun and the 3D glasses. Another idea was to have one object consistent for all of my images, and it is also another idea that I have kept. In each image, one of the models is wearing a pair of 3D glasses. As a collection, they look their best. I wish I had edited these images differently because I would have liked to have given them a spin instead of being plain photographs. Like giving them a clockwork border, for example, like the images in my steampunk book. Overall, my images work well together. Despite my complaints, I'm quite proud of this project.